present in Virgo's reading. Let's see what's coming up for you. <laughs> oh my God, I feel you're separating or separated from a certain power that I hear residual power that was left within you. And this could have been energy from a past relationship that was it left some traumatic energy within you, some dark energy. It literally could be talking about magic, the magician powers. There's a lot going on. I feel like you may have a lot of people in your space right now. You could be crowded with work. Okay, because I feel work. I feel like you're not getting a lot of opportunity to really express yourself because you're bummed. But it could be a lot of work, I feel, because Virgos like working. So I feel maybe you don't have space to express your emotions right now. Okay, or you're not, uh, maybe you're not in an intimate relationship right now. Or you're not able to give your partner a lot of affection because um, maybe you're missing in action because you're, there's you're bombarded with work there's so many different things that you're working on too it could be love like maybe some of you your love is it's not locked down but there's a there's i don't know there's not a lot of affection or communication going on with you and yours at this point and there's a separation or you're wanting to separate from a dark energy here all right now let us get started with your tarot messages i have for you here <clears throat> that's the messages out for virgo the high priestess in the reverse the high priest oh hey the hermit so virgo the hermit is your energy you could be seeking out to reconnect or to seek out answers or clarity um it, it's like you want to this person you want to go back to <clears throat> a person possibly to get some answers from them as if you know that this person holds some answers or some secrets because the high priestess is one that knows mysteries and secrets and magic right, we were just talking about magic some of you could be um, reaching out to a healer or a wise person um a, you know a tarot reader perhaps or some um a reader a reader a reader okay that could give you some information possibly about this dark energy that we were feeling over here maybe you want to know how to clear up all the there's a lot of it's not conflict it's just that you have a lot on your plate right now going on and you want a break you want to take a breath you'd like to be in this hermit mode some of you'd like to go on a vacation take yourself away you could be traveling to meet someone to realign with someone Maybe you want to apologize, okay? The High Priestess card is Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio here. Taking a break. Some of you do want to take a break and <laughs> tune into your spiritual side or your spiritual nature or something about... Because maybe you are one Virgo that normally puts yourself out there. I feel like you want to possibly relax, Relax, allow just to hear your own voice, the sound of your own thinking, your own thoughts going through your head. Maybe having to do, like, it could be having to do with a separation, a breakup perhaps, all right? And you want to go back, but you want clarity first, maybe before you can move on. So you want to reach out to this person. You're trying to maybe connect to this person emotionally. Maybe you're not physically, you're, maybe you're trying to reach out to this person, but they're not answering you, look. Like this could be a telephone call that's turned down or not being received, not being received, not going through. So you're trying possibly to reach out, but it's not going through. Remember Virgo that um, this could be your person's energy. Um, let me just chip in my introduction here. This is Sage, Sunset Healing Tarot. Thank you so much for being here, Virgo. These are general tarot card readings. And so all of the messages may not apply to all of you. So do take what applies, Virgo, and the rest, let it fly. So welcome in Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and Cross Watchers. I feel Cross Watcher energy here. Water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. It could be you want to go back. You, you maybe are saying, I thought about this. I thought about something and maybe wanting to reconnect. Any other messages for Virgo in this time? Hmm. 
okay um on the bottom of the deck we have the two of wands some people could be single there could be a lack of passion and desire when it comes to dealing with other people and this is also you know um you aligning with your intuition i feel a lot about your intuition in this reading virgo so just take that at, as it applies to you learn how to tune into your higher nature take a break the hermit card virgo is really you taking a break um um getting divine guidance also and um yeah, because the four of wands is spiritual, is very spiritual for me too. It's about that stability, that place of stability in yourself, knowing who you are, listening to yourself. That's what I'm saying. I do feel like there's a lot going on and you just want a, a place of peace and quiet within you so that you can, so that the answers can come up in you. You know that the answers are within you. Okay, so you're going inside. This is introspection here. You need, there's some answers that you're looking for. You, you're seeking for something having to do, what is, what is the hermit or the high priest? What is the high priestess card here for Virgo? High priestess energy. Some of you could be traveling, moving or receiving a message. Receiving a message. Okay, some of you could be busy working still, focusing on work. It could be work that's bombarding you. You have a lot of work to do. Mm. There's something ending. Because <laughs> you're about to seek your own happiness and put your own happiness first. See? It's like you're about to align. There's something align with uh, there's love here. You could want to go back to a person. Someone may be spying on you, Virgo. Someone may be watching you. Someone may be watching you. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Air sign. Any other messages for Virgo? Anything that wants to be clarified? All right, we have the seven of pentacles. So I feel like you're... Um, it has to do with your sense of value and your sense of self-worth, the love that you have for yourself. We do have the Ace of Hearts here. So there's genuine love here. Like you love, I feel like you love yourself. You have innate love within you, love that no one can take away or give to you. But it's like you're seeking out this high priestess energy because you want cl clarity. But that's not all it is. There's something more. It's like you want something from this person this person has an answer that you want that's going to make your life i feel you could i'm reading for an older person too you know you have had a lot of experiences in life i'm gonna stop shuffling um so the message here is follow your heart. I have strong cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy here, strong water sign, trust in your emotions, use your intuition to make the decisions that you need to break if you, that you need to make, if you need to take a break, Virgo from work or to, or from people around you, like everyone has an opinion in your life, I feel. And if you need to really, I feel like there's a higher presence that you're seeking out. This, as if this person is your one. I, I really want, to, like this person is a wizard. Yes. So I'm getting, you're, you're traveling the distance to possibly go connect with a, a wizard energy that's far away just so that you can get an answer. Okay. For, some, so for something that you're seeking, possibly having to do with, it's, it's love here. Some of you are in an entanglement with more than one people. I feel you want to relax or relent or lay something down. I do feel like you're, you have a strong air sign presence within your life. This person may want to keep you trapped or, or you feel trapped in this connection because you may want to. This feels new. The Page of Cups could feel like new energy. You want to have a new experience in love. I feel forgiveness as well. But this, with the high priestess in the reverse, it's as if this person was not responding to you. They're not picking up on the communication, whether that's telepathy or 
sending an email or a message or a phone call, this person is not receiving from you. They are actually blocking you with the Queen of Swords energy. They have, it's like they, they have their antennas out, like, are their security guards are waiting for any communication that may come in from you and then they block you. So they, this person has a security team too, all right? So watch out. Be aware. I feel like this all depends on how you approach this person. We have the page of cups. So um, I feel like you are going with a message. Or, you know, as I say, I'm feeling like this is you, Virgo. Because we have the hermit and you are the seeker here. I feel like you're the one that needs to relax. But it could be the cross watcher's energy that is seeking answers and clarity. Taking a break, wanting to relax, wanting to go to you, Virgo, with an offer. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, Scorpio, a message of love, happiness, forgiveness, okay? Maybe that's what you want to receive. Some of you le are, are aligning with your heart space, your intuition, going on a journey on your own. I feel like you're just laying down your burdens, are, are you know, not accepting advice from people around you anymore. You're, you're, you're building your, your standards and your boundaries up. That's what I feel for you. You're learning about your own standards, your boundaries, your integrity, your self-respect. And tapping back into this innate place of love that no one can take from you or give to you. Alright, I'm leaving your messages here. Okay. Okay. And I want to say thank you so much for being here. Thank you for watching these videos. I do hope you find messages in these readings that resonate with you and is able to help guide you along your journey. Um, if you do find messages that resonate, go ahead and compliment this video by leaving a thumbs up on the video, liking the video here, right? And subscribing to the channel for more uploads for you in the future. Also, go ahead and share the video with those that you love. So, of course, there's love, confusion, suspicion. You're expecting something. Maybe you're expecting a call. Maybe you're waiting on the opportunity to go and reconnect with this, per per reconnect with this person, Virgo. There was definitely... Um, a separation someone walked away having to do with a cancerian energy taurus so cancer and earth sign cancer pisces scorpio taurus virgo capricorn here someone may be coming into your world someone may be coming into your world and this is an abundant energy as if this person is arriving from the heavens this is a heavenly card for me archangel michael your blessings maybe someone may be answering your call after all Okay, to hear what you're saying, maybe this is what you've wanted all along, and it could be that you're the one that's wanting to return to this person's life and uh, and just and bring everything, or you just want to see this person because this per it feels like this is the person that you want to see. This is how you are imagining their look. You're imagining that they're looking, so you're just waiting for the time to go around and see this person. All right, maybe you want clarity or you think you may be able to have a new beginning. All right, with this energy, I'm leaving a reading here. Thank you so much for being here. Much love to you and guidance along your journey. If you'd like to support this channel, make a donation, buy me a gift or any beautiful thing like that, do check out the description box below this video for more information on that. If you'd like a personal reading to clarify your situation what you're currently going through lovely virgo do go ahead and check out the description box or email me at victoria salki at gmail.com or sage sunset tarot at outlook.com all the information is below just click on the links copy and paste all right to get some clarifications for what's really going on because i do see you need some guidance. We have water signs standing out for you once more. Leaving it here. Thank you. Bye. Take care until next time.